Good morning! Abby and I are at Erin Park in Erin Mills, Ontario. We're gonna go find a spot to have a picnic by the creek, right? Yeah. Yeah, we gotta hurry. We only got an hour. Come on with us. That's the Credit River. Look at all the debris up there. All right, picnic shelter over here. All right, we came here a few weeks ago and we spotted a picnic bench down here that we thought might be a great spot. Just take your time. A little bit steep but it looked to us like this would be a great spot down here for a picnic there we go it's perfect okay we're not staying down here it's too buggy Abby is really, really upset. I'm hoping it's just because she's tired. She's ditching up there already. Not having fun. Would rather leave than put on bug spray. Goodbye, perfect spot. Maybe you and I'll get together soon. It was a good plan. Busted. Busted. No point dealing with a miserable child. It's gonna suck all the fun, all the pleasure, any relaxation. Gone! So I'll try this another day by myself. Thanks for joining me for this aborted attempt at ramen for breakfast by the creek. All right, plan B. We aborted this morning's breakfast at the creek mission. Lesson learned, that's a parenting fail on my part. 21 years later, I forgot that you need to feed him before you take him out. So we're now fed, we're hydrated, we have cold drink and we're going to the pool. And we're going to swim some laps to get our exercise today. Mm -hmm. I still think that's a perfect spot at the creek, and I do intend to go back. Can you go back with me someday? Yeah. Bug spray first? Someday. Bug spray first. Ready for a swim? Yeah. Yeah, me too. So in the month of August, I have joined the uh, fundraiser for Heart and Stroke Canada. I'm going to be trying to do 50 kilometers in the month of August, that's just over a kilometer of a day, or a mile a day, I guess. It's not really that much. Pretty simple, right? Ideally, I'm hoping we're going to finish over a hundred kilometers in August. Today is a warm-up day for us. We've hiked a couple kilometers by the time we get back to my mom's place, and then we're going to do some swimming. I think for the Heart and Stroke Foundation, you can walk, run, bike, swim, um, whatever. Uh, the goal is to raise awareness and to raise money. I am not going to be actively fundraising. If you feel that you need or are compelled to donate money to Canadian Heart Stroke, please do so. More importantly, take care of your ticker. Take care of your heart, right? Take care of our bodies. We only get one, right? Yeah. So we're just about back at my mom's place. When we get there, Abby and I will have walked about three kilometers today, about a mile and a half, I think. Feel pretty good? Yeah. Pretty good. Kilometer a day, not so much. It should be easy, peasy, lemon squeezy.
We did it. We walked about three kilometers today, not in the forest by the creek as I would have hoped, but we got our steps in anyways. Feel good? Yeah, yeah a little bit hot and sweaty. Just a little bit. Yeah, time for a swim. Let's go jump in the pool. I have my bathing suit. Me too. Lesson learned or reminded on my part. I need to carry most of the stuff, especially when it's a hot day. We need to have breakfast before we go. We need to hydrate before we go. And then I need to carry most of the stuff. I do have enough in here for both of us. I got, uh, that's uh, water and cranberry juice. I got a Nalgene over there. We got all the stuff in here for all of us. Abby's pack is not actually that heavy. She's got a, a water bottle in there. She's got water shoes in there. She's got a towel, sunscreen, hat, and then some snacks and stuff. Pretty light, but on a hot day like this, it definitely adds to the wine factor. So I have to recalculate, recalculate my strategy when going for a hike with my daughter, who's not quite an adult yet. Still has kid tendencies. I need to be a little more mama prepared if I want to have a half the time on the trail. Abby's in the pool, which makes her very happy. She does not handle the heat well, but she does love the water. I am going to take my socks and shoes off. And I'm going to drink this. This is um, not Gatorade Zero. This is water with a little bit of Gatorade Propel and some cranberry juice in there. I am definitely dehydrated after that walk. So I'm going to have some more before I jump in the pool and go swimming. Sweaty socks, sweaty shoes. Put those over there. Cool off. Time to hydrate. That was totally my fault. That was a rookie mistake. I knew it was going to be hot, but we started a lot later than I anticipated. We have all the good stuff. We have stuff to cook breakfast. We have snacks. We have water. We have stuff to stay cool. We have stuff to stay shelter. We have everything we need, but we didn't have breakfast first. We started late. We hit the trail late. We were already hungry. As soon as the mosquitoes showed up, the hangry showed up. and. You know, I know better than that. That's just a recipe for disaster. So we're gonna recover by hanging out here at the pool the rest of the afternoon. Abby's having a great time in there. Maybe it's got some kids her own age to play with. I'm gonna go join her in there in a little bit. And then tomorrow, we'll try to hit the trail again. This time, this time, with a much better plan for success. I do have one technical difficulty being in the pool instead of the, the river. I only have my bathing suit bottoms. I didn't bring a bathing suit top. I just have my bra and a t-shirt and there's no street clothes allowed in here. So Abby is harassing me to get in the pool and I don't know what to do because there's a neighbor here now and I don't want to break the rules and get my mom in trouble and this day just keeps spiraling on me. <laughs> you having fun? Is it better? Yeah. Day saved? Mm -hmm. Excellent. That was totally my fault. I know better than that. We plan to get up early and go and make breakfast by the creek, by the river. Abby could play in the river, have fun, I cook, then we could eat and go back to pick my mom from physio. Simple, right? I knew it was gonna be hot, so I have lots of stuff for hydration, lots of stuff to stay cool, and I got lots of bug spray, but but we should have had breakfast first before we left. We were later than we thought when we were planning. And my mom's appointment got pushed back a little bit later than it normally is. And I didn't calculate that. You know, I'm just dumb, I guess. <laughs> it's just dumb. We had some drinks before we left, but we didn't have any food. And that just increases the, the you know, the wine factor. and that makes the hangries come on and that's just not any fun for anybody so 
We'll try again tomorrow.